Can you hear me? No? Well, I want to thank you all for coming. It's a heck of a lot bigger crowd than I anticipated. I said two to three hundred. Somebody said two to three thousand. And I told them they were nuts. <laughs> anyway, I want to introduce you to the mayor of Barnegat Light. Those of you who are residents in Barnegat Light know who we speak of. I am not a resident, so I only know him as a member of the Friends of Barnegat Lighthouse State Park. Anyway, I give you Kirk Larson, Mayor of Barnegat Light. Thank you. We all have to give, uh, I, he told me how to speak long enough so he can run up to the top and turn it, turn it on. Get going. I don't speak very long. Well, anyway, I want to thank everybody. My, my brother-in-law, Jimmy Gatowski, just called me coming over to bridge. He's bumper to bumper from Surf City to Barney of Light. So, um, I don't know where. <laughs> Go alongside the road if you hear anything on the news and just watch it from there. Uh, I can see there's not a lot of room left here. So, so boy, I'll tell you, this is exciting. Barney of Light has been people in one spot for a long time. But anyway, I'd like to say a few things as a mariner my entire life. This is probably going to be one of the neatest things that we've had um, since they put the lights on the White House, uh, which was great. But if you think about the 1850s, the 1850s, this was probably something in today's, in today's time, like launching a satellite and... Uh, I mean, just think about it. Building something that high on a beach with no railroad, no, no nothing. So, and, and it's still here. And, and then somebody turned it off in 1921. Um, but with all the GPS, satellites, everything that we have available to us as seamen, uh, this is still going to be great. It's still going to be something that it may save somebody's life someday. Who knows, your boat sinks, they like, see the light and swim that direction. Um, it's, it's going to be great for the mariners just, uh, just to set a course for home when you see it blink. And, uh, you know, one thing Angela is going to hear is, I don't know if we should give out his home phone number, but should it ever go out, I don't know who we're going to call. So. I'm sure they're going to call me. <laughs> <laughs> and everybody has my phone number. Uh, when the horn went out on the South Jetty, everybody called me. So uh, we well, can all call me again. So uh, I, I just want to say this is probably one of the neatest things going away. Uh, uh, I'm proud to be uh, be the mayor at the time it happened. I'm proud that uh, all you folks actually care this much. It's really, it's really, really good. And they're still walking in. <laughs> There's something free down there. <laughs> I think it's free light, right? But anyway, uh, I don't know if the Angelo all the way up there, but so we're hoping uh, within by five to five fifteen that the light will be lit. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. So and chill to see everybody here tonight. The uh, lighting of the lighthouse is due to. The lighting of the lighthouse is due to a tremendous amount of donations from a number of groups and organizations here on Long Beach Island, and uh, primarily was uh, spearheaded by the Friends of Barney and Light State Park, who are incorporated here at the State Park. So, welcome everyone. We'll be lighting the lighthouse shortly. I won't know when, they're, when the light's going to go on. You'll have to watch. Thank you.
My love and I went sailing on a choppy white cat sea. The morning mist was lifting, the wind was on our lee. Off in the west we saw the beam rotating round and round. What a welcome sight was Barnegat Light guiding us homeward bound. 